Ryo B and JFlex, both New Jersey players. Uh, they have a pretty long history of going back and forth. JFlex not being as active recently. Ryo Beat on the grind, sponsored. Let's see how this goes. Ryo Beat has uh, some new tech with turn up drop, so watch, that was it. So watch out for that. Uh, you'll see him doing that quite often where he kind of just uh, double jump, drops the turn up, and uses an attack out of it. Yeah, that's knitting. It's called knitting. Um, and he uses that offensively really cool. JFlex is pretty patient, uh, so expect a, a spacing battle for sure. I find similar to, um, to Marth, Peach has to be pretty opportunistic. She should win neutral in terms of the way she can space, but uh, Peach obviously has tools to counter, to counter that for sure. So I don't know who won the last set between these two. Hey, uh, I will vote. What's up, Adamist? Really, I was saying you would know just as well a, a classic rivalry. Oh, with uh, Nico and JFlex? Nico and uh, JFlex, yeah. yeah. There's a, I don't know who won the last time they played. I want to believe it's Nico Ooh. because Flex has been a little bit of a washed up Flex as of late. Yeah, yeah, he's on the work grind. Oh, okay. You're going to see Nico try to do that a lot. Like when uh, JFlex jumps up, try to sneak under with a dash attack. Again, yeah. you have to be like super opportunistic as Peach. Well, yeah, because in this matchup, uh, Sheik's neutral just is so much stronger than Peach's in general. Yeah. Is it's, the kinda, thing. it's kinda similar to Mars in yeah. that regard. Oh like, my god, three dash attacks right there. Like, as long as you don't fall for dash attacks, you basically have control over the entire Yeah, absolutely. Ground. You should be able to uh, control the pace. And if Sheik wanted, uh, you could even go to platforms and, and you can't, don't Yeah, because yeah. he's so much stronger in that Ooh. regard. J-Flex trying to call, call out the, uh, the recovery with a forward air. Ooh, dunk on him! I uh, didn't get the dunk turned up. Recovery. Oh, okay. Double. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Probably got to be careful. Yeah. You have time to throw out two there. You got a little uh, too antsy when it came to recovering. Yeah. Got to play it a lot more Ooh. patiently. I think another powerful tool for Peach in this matchup is reading jumps. Yeah, well, uh, she's really good at that against any characters that don't have, like, yeah. busted recoveries. Yeah. I think another thing that's going to be very good for her in this matchup is uh, working with back air. Cool. Because if you miss space anything like that, like the forward tilt, she easily gets another hit yeah. in. Yeah, absolutely. Jake likes playing pretty patient. Kind of just sitting, needling, itching forward. Ooh, I love the down tilt. That was a very good punish. That was a sick conversion. Peach's, uh, Peach's down tilt is like a very strong tool against Sheik just because of the spacing of it. Oh, absolutely. And it definitely messes up a lot of like her short hop approaches and things like that. And at low percent, she even crouch cancel some of his moves. And yeah. Ooh. Nice. Very good read. I love how he uh, floated like kind of in between the platform to kind of cover and drift wherever he went. That's insane. Peach is at 60 and she can still fully crouch cancel Sheik Fair and still He's get punished. That's so a fat princess. Bowser has been treating her well. Bowser yeah. <laughs> beefing her up. She's a fat princess. Are you trying to say Bowser's into, into thicker women? Maybe. Right. Maybe. This is cl clearly. <laughs> <laughs> so Nico up right now. Um, ooh, I was telling people he's been doing that uh, turn up job with the aerials. So the new thing he's been working on. Wow. Nice. He has to attack. He, he needs to st and stop hurts. missing attacks. Yeah. It hurts if you don't uh, hit that attack. Okay, there you go. Nico's very good at punishing people in those instances, like the little skirmishes where they yep. don't attack out of things. How do you feel like Nico's winning like the skirmishes right now in general? Just like they're trying to scrap, yeah. and uh, Nico's just kind of out, out dueling him. Why would he nair? Good question. Hey, it doesn't matter. It's set up for the kill. Again, kind of misjudge the uh, back air. He's playing a little too antsy, like I said, when it comes to recovery. Yeah. You gotta start using the parasol. All right. Nice. Ooh. Nice, really good punish. Wait, that's grab, yeah. Oh, all right. I like the attempt. Yeah, it's just usually interesting to see how his flex gonna get out of the corner when uh, Peach has center stage. Nico keeps throwing out like the preemptive hitboxes, yep. trying to bait flex into things, but if he just sits there and waits like he's doing now, yeah. it's a lot harder. If he runs at you, you can react to it. You, know, yeah. you have to trust your reaction sometimes. Especially and, uh, in this matchup. Yep. Ooh, wow, that forward, that forward tilt just hit. Trying to cover the shield drop with the up, uh, up air. Aw, oh, you made the textbook mistake. Yep. He knows. Ooh, okay. Is he forward air or up air? I think it'll be forward air. This is a very good positioning. Yep. Oh, wow, right at that time. There we go. That nice. was a really good up air. Anytime he gets an up air, it's, uh, it's usually pretty nice. That had to have been. There's no way he could have predicted the, the air dodge, so it had to be yeah. a mistake. Nice. I think it's hard for Peach to cover if she's uh, holding ledge. If she goes to platform, I don't that, think Peach has a good way to get it there. No, that was a lot of damage she just got. 
Oh, I thought he had that jab. Uh, trying to do like the fox combo. There we go. Oh, he takes those. Yeah. Very good. All right, this is definitely Perfect. doable. Let's just see how he can avoid the low percent like crowd canceling. He's got to respect him when he's yeah. on the platform. If he doesn't do that, he doesn't respect the obvious things that Peach can go for. He should be fine because he oh, was outplaying wow. him in neutral. So he just tried to like rely on Alex facing his bear, and Nico read it really hard. This might be it. Okay, he's living. Oh, uh, he's getting hit with a lot of dash attacks. Way more. Oh, he's gonna keep short hopping in place. He can't be doing yeah. that. Especially when you're cornered, you don't you don't wow. gain enough from it. I'm surprised he lived. This is gonna be a really hard comeback. He's at really high percent. I hate seeing that. Yeah. The, the forward air to shield grab. I think he's living. No. Nah. Oh wow. So I would guess Nico's gonna ban. What would Nico ban here? Yoshi's. Yoshi's. Yeah, Yoshi's. So he's gonna go Pokemon. Maybe Pokemon. Maybe uh, maybe Battlefield. True. Battlefield as well. Flex did, Flex does well with space. Yeah. Nah, he just doesn't need uh, that much space. We're going to Battlefield, right? We'll be up 1 0. Let's see how Flex. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, he's starting aggressive. Ooh, good there, right there. He read okay. it that time. Already, as a good player, should adapting pretty well. Ooh. Nice. Hit him with the Fox combo. <laughs> this is like a new, new Sheik right now. Oh, my God. Very, very, very good. I know Nico has the fire attack, but Flex is kind of kind of roasting him right now. Kind of sizzling kinda right now. Sizzling. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. Very nice. Sick. Flex is committing a lot more to when he gets a hit. I agree. Not as uh, scared, I guess. Yeah, because he realizes when he when he was doing well last game, it was when he was going in when he got landed yeah. the hits. He's not giving him as much credit as he was before. Right. That was super nice of uh, the buried. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. He's still getting. I want to see him dodge those uh, dash attacks a little bit more though. Ooh, okay. Good anti. Nice. Anti edge guard. TV. Makes it. Oh. Nice. We take those trades. If you're yeah. Sheik, you're happy. Nico giving it to him for free. But putting up that wall. One of the more technical peaches you'll see. Let's see how he. Uh, Does Nico goes. still play with only tap jump? Uh, yeah. That was a very does. good recovery by Fox there. That was sick. 41%, you take those. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. that's the turn up drop. 38%, 41% from it. Okay, well, it's not over. Flex, Flex was doing well this game. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's just like these little nice. opportunities that Nico's just kind of getting. Yeah, I feel like it's because Peach has a much more uh, like DI mix ups with her hitboxes yeah, and things true. like that. And it's so easy like to cross somebody up with their, mix someone up with their DI and then yeah. just like, get so much out of it. That's definitely true. Oh, nice. Okay. The run around. Nice. Go run around the platform just to throw out a bear. Very Try, ooh, okay. Very patient neutral for the most part there. Yeah. I'm not sure if a flex shield drops a lot, but it would benefit him. Oh, especially in this matchup, yeah. yeah. I don't like flex in that area. He hasn't been doing well. Yeah, when, when, you, when you corner him, you just short hop forward airs in the hopes yeah. that you mess up. I think uh, Nico is kind of good enough and played him enough to kind of see through that at this point. Yeah. Ooh, nice. good wall though. But at the same time, when he's on the other side, it still works. So I think uh, it's almost safe to say that like whoever has the better stage position. Oh, he's definitely winning in this exchange. Definitely these winning. Yeah. Yeah, it should be death. Yeah. Wow. So a pretty comfortable lead. Peach is usually a trade character, but like trading's gonna hurt here. You'll take it, but you don't want to get out of crowd cancel percent. Yeah, that's the, the biggest thing that he has to work with still. Oh, if he gets his edge guard, that'd be okay. Let's see how he uh, controls the space though. Nair, forward air. Flex taking his top. No, oh, okay. That was good. Yep. 42%. Not, you're not sad if you need. Oh, okay. Nice. That was a very questionable Nair. That was. So it doesn't matter, Nico overcommitted for some reason. Oh, good jab. Wow. Yeah, I, I don't know. Flex is just really uh, struggling in that corner. Or maybe, Ooh, maybe it's Nico's very good when he's pressuring at the corner. For yeah, because sure. he like he's one of the quickest uh, peaches. So the wall he puts up is is really good. It's definitely him in a BMC yeah. in that sense. True. All right, so let's see if uh, Flex can put this the game, uh, game three. Ooh, nice, very good bear in that instance. Pushed him off and didn't get punished for it. You know, Flex hasn't been like threatening grab too much. I feel like. 
Because I feel like the instances in which he's tried it, he got uh, he got like 60% when he messed up. Yeah, and there yeah, we go. Yeah. This should be death. Uh, yeah. yeah. That was rough. Because I feel like Nico was doing a lot of good things that game. Even though Flex did uh, make a lot of great ad adaptations. It definitely, it definitely helped the stage layout. Definitely helped a lot more. There wasn't as much room between the platforms, I thought, but like from the ground and the platform, whereas where Nico got a lot of punishes in the game, first game about it. Yeah, definitely. So now we have FD. Usually, a Sheik's not, not, not their favorite stage. But Peach excels here against like every character she can combo really well. But, but J-Flex is really, really okay with just charging up those needles, yeah. counting them up. He's very good at just playing the patient game and then, yeah. and then occasionally messing up a roll with forward smash. But he has to give uh, respect Nico's aggression. Which because Nico's been surprising him. I think that's the big thing that changed from set, from game one up until yeah. now. Ooh, okay. Where he he respects his aggression, but he also fully commits when he hits him now. All right, so like, uh, cut off for a second, but opportunity cost. Flex went for that edge guard to the left. He missed it, and now uh, he tried the stage position after that, so. One of these little hits is gonna has the ability to, to cool. generate such a large lead oh for God. Flex. Looking like Armada. Oh, I love the way uh, Nico is moving right now. He's threatening so many things. Although they're kind of far from each other. But now, but, but that was Flex giving him a little too much credit in yes. that instance. Yes. And if he keeps it up, it's gonna help Nico gain a little bit of a lead. Okay. But thankfully, so. Flex committed at the end. Let's see what Nico needs to do now. Oh, there you go. That was really sick. Let's see if he gets off. Ooh, no, another yeah. buffer roll turned into a forward smash. Yep. Uh, he needs his edge guard. Nice. Oh, that was so good, sick. Very good read. A lot of people probably would have just held ledge, but uh, really smart to read that. Ooh, grab you guys to turn up. This is where Peach wants to be, right? Like, Peach wants to be here. Yeah, she wants to pressure him into the corner, but the it, there you he's go. not getting as much as he should be from the telegraph needles that he's doing. Yeah. J Vlogs is spacing his aerials around down smash well though. Yeah. He's not getting punished too hard off it. Nice, you read yeah. the down smash there. Should be I think there. that's like the the big game changer in this stock at least is that he has got hit with the down smash that uh, Oh no, that's the every peach Ooh. in the every peach in the area. The second they're yes. so good at punishing off of the down smash. Yeah, it's crazy. No matter how much the percent may be different, uh, you still got that in the back pocket, so. Yep. Okay, so let's see. Let's see if uh oh nice. wow, that hurts. Very that good. Hurts. Flex doing a very good job of just like as I said before, overall adapting to Nico's playstyle from game one up until now. Yeah, I think so. And I think he's spacing really well. Like his aerials are not getting punished super hard. Like he knows when he needs to commit, he knows exactly when you should back off and try to bait him into more situations. And Nico's aggression hasn't been as effective these past two games. Maybe Flex is just in his head at this point. I think uh, Nico should maybe do some more turn ups. Yep. Yeah, it would definitely Ooh, help. Oh, weak nair to back air. He's living, but. Do that one, doesn't pull another one. So I think you need SP, all the help you can, uh, getting in, right? And yeah. uh, turn ups give you that opportunity. I think he's gonna get slapped. Oh, oh, oh. No, that was a uh, good choice. That had to have been like a tech flub. Yeah. Maybe he wasn't expecting the DI. Kind of just threw him off. Good movement. Wow. There we go. Okay. He was fishing for that like the yeah. entire time. Oh, man. So this is looking very, very grim for uh, Nebs' own boy, Nico. Yeah, yeah. So the thing is that <laughs> nice, Peach very is good. not the easiest comeback character. That and Sheik versus Peach on this stage is so hard for Peach. It makes Peach. me wonder what uh, Nico banned. I'm assuming he might have banned like Yoshi's or something like that. Yeah. Ooh, that was sick. All right. Let's see if uh, Nico can get like a Johnny stock of sorts. And, All he uh, needs is one down smash, you know? Yeah, true. This is a lot of damage though. Dave likes in a super happy spot. He doesn't need to do That's, anything. This might be it. Yeah. He does not need to do anything right now. Cool. Good job oh. getting back. Oh, that's it. Uh, oh wait, smash the AI up. That's, that's it. it. Yeah. All right, well, good set. J Flex takes it two one over Ryo Beats, and I believe we're up. It should be us, yeah. Yeah. yeah.